Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to tonight's high school varsity basketball action at the Oliver Wolcott Technical School Gymnasium in Torrington, Connecticut. It's the site of the Berkshire League CTC Christmas Tournament, and it's the championship game here between the Gilbert Yellow Jackets and Oliver Walcott Tech. My name is Mike Kurtz. I have my co-host with me, Bill Richman, and we have Tim Wheeler on camera tonight. Yeah, Mike, we're ready to go. It's just like a return from last year. We were here uh, on Tuesday night where uh, North, uh, Gilbert beat uh, Housatonic. Uh, 74 to 33 in the first round of the game, and uh, uh, Woka Tech had beaten O'Brien Tech, and then tonight in the uh, second, and third, or third and first place game, O'Brien Tech won that game 56 to 29. So it's the second year of this tournament, and uh, we just heard the PA announcer say before that uh, next year it will be hosted by Housatonic. So, so it's the become same an teams. annual Christmas week tradition, and uh, last year. Gilbert won the inaugural tournament. Yeah, and they a did. Nail biter, 58-57 over Oliver Walcott Tech. That's uh, yeah. So it's really exciting to you know get a little uh, uh, holiday tournament going on here and, and uh, a couple of quick games. One game was in conference with the Housatonics. They had to do that as in conference, and then the other game is a, a, an out of conference game, but. It's always nice here. Sort of reminds me of the Hive. It's uh, really only uh, stands on one side, and they are right on the court. Yes, right? uh, it's yeah. a cozy gymnasium is the best way to describe it. And uh, each team comes in with a record. Uh, Gilbert is two and one, and Wolcott Tech is one and one. And as I said just a moment ago, this is a, a literally a rematch of last year's tournament final, which was really a, a fun, competitive, close game that wasn't literally decided till the final second. Yeah. Close. The Yellow Jackets are coached by Mark Douglas, and now we have the player introductions. Corey, Corey Schmidt. Number 13, Nolan Adams. Number 34, Adam Baraga. Number 44, Adam Baraga had a big 20-point, 20-rebound double-double in the first game yeah. of the tournament. Adam's one of the uh, captains, and Grayson Ersoni is the other uh, captain, and now uh, John Devaney, who uh, scored 21 points in that game on Tuesday. Coach Douglas, Douglas is assisted by Dan Jones and Jerry Brochu, the longtime assistants, along with Mark in the Gilbert program. And now 18 we years for uh, Coach Douglas. From machine tool number two, Chris Small. He's a player I remember from last year. Chris Small, number two. Number five, Devin Schmidt. Devin Schmidt, sophomore, 6'3. Elijah Reed. Gavin Davis. Gavin Davis, senior. Sidoti ended up with 14 points in their win over Brian Tech the other night. And now, ladies and gentlemen, let's pay respects to the Yeah, Tech is coached by Dean Pergola and assisted by Ray Tangway. And now we'll pause for the playing of our national anthem. And that's Ray on the uh, PA over there. Thank you.
Mike, what's your opinion on uh, the uh, national anthem and uh, starting lineups? Which order do you like better? I like the starting lineup first, followed by the national anthem. But that's just my personal preference. All right. Well, Ben Gilbert, it doesn't happen that way because I like it the other way. <laughs> because I like to get the whole crowd going and then get the game going. <laughs> yeah. That's right. interesting. I wonder how, uh, what's, what is the, the norm? Just thought of that. But All right. Just a moment away from tip off. The ball is up and it's controlled by Oliver Walcott. So 21 is Shot Shidoni. from the corner. It's Ooh, good by 11. number 11. Elijah Reed. Elijah Reed, Reed opens the scoring with a three. It's zone. They get it to oh. Adams at the top of the key. Passes to the wing for three. Schmidt for three, right? They Corey gave him a Schmidt three. answers. We're tied at three. Reed takes it in the lane, spins, banks oh, it up boy. and in. Nice move by Reed. Pushed his way down there and then got good position. So, 2 3 zone. Adams. Ursoni oh. dishes down low to Baraga. He's double teamed, passes out of it. Uh oh. And it's going to come all the way over to our table. Is it still alive? <laughs> we are literally on the edge of the court here. Yeah, I guess we better move back a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> and it looks like it's tech ball. Yeah. So Reed. Tech's going to work it around. And then Key jumper by number 21, Sadati off the mark. Schmidt had the rebound. Ursoni from the corner. Short. Outlets to Small. He takes it down the lane, puts up a shot. Locked. Deflected by yeah. Devaney. It'll stay with Tech. 6.20 to go in the opening period. 5-3 in favor of Walcott Tech. To start pushing the ball. Man to man. Small kicks to Sadati, takes it into the lane. Bank shot, no good. Baraga comes out with a loose ball. Out. Oh. Schmidt's shot is blocked. Yes, yeah, Sedoti with the block. Small comes out with the loose ball. 5 3. Good Guarded job. closely Good by Ersoni. Good D by Ersoni. Ersoni created the turnover there. They're packing it in. Ball's taken away by Reed. He's going to take it down the lane. Puts up a shot. Doesn't go, but he does draw a foul. Nolan Adams. Way to go. See, I like that referee. He should not only put it up, he said it to us, too. So Reed, who has... Wolka Tech's five points, looking to add to it here. Around both sides of the rim and rolls out. Second shot is good. Six three. For Sony, long three, no yeah. good. 
Schmidt with the rebound. They get oh. it down low and a reverse oh. layup by number 15. Need a timeout. Kevin Davis. Yeah. Coach Douglas wants a timeout. He needed a timeout. Trailing by five, eight to three, eight to with three. 451 remaining in the first. Tech is really pushing the ball up and, and making the plays. And as we saw on uh, uh, Tuesday night, uh, when Gilbert can run with the ball, they, their offense is much better you know, in transition. than that set offense, they had some trouble, and they're packing it in down there. They can't get it down low. That's where Braga had all his points last time. So either they got to hit some outside shots on there to, to bring them out or uh, move the ball quicker for the, that foul line, right, get to the foul line, and then get those people cutting. Uh, to try to create that offense in the uh, in the set offense. We should note that erstwhile all Berkshire League athletic trainer Bob Snyder is also in attendance here tonight. Shot from the corner, no good. And there's a foul on the rebound. Baraya. Looks like they're going to get Baraga. That's the other thing, that they can't get into foul trouble. So Playing Chet's like really their only bench they got. The pressure applied in the backcourt by the Yellow Jackets. Reed breaks it easily though, gets it up court, takes a shot, no uh. good. But the rebound, unfortunately, can't be controlled by Adam Baraga, so it'll stay with Tech underneath their own basket. Sadaudi to inbound. And throws it out of bounds. Passes Aaron, goes out of bounds, and back over to Gilbert. They get it inside oh, to Barabi. Double they, team. They come on. It's oh. taken away. Another block, Sedoni in there inside. He's a big kid. Six Smalls two. with the drive, oh. lays it up and in on the assist from Sadati. Ten to three. Back rim shot, no good. Rebound to Reed. He's going to push it across the timeline. Uh. But his pass is a little bit too tall for Schmidt, and it goes out of bounds back to Gilbert. So they have not gotten any transition baskets here. That's you know they're all set up and they're just not hitting that outside shot. They're settling for that three. There it is. Where's the cut? Picked up his dribble. They get it to Barag on the elbow. Back to Schmidt for three. Uh. No good. Rebound to Tech. They're Sadati. playing tough. Baraga. Foul line jumper is good. <laughs> Wing three from the corner, no good. Nolan Adams. Quickly in transition. Walcott check and one. Wow. Gavin Davis will go to the free throw line to try to convert the old fashioned three point play. First sub in the game for Tech, number 20 comes in. Mike Capetto, he's a senior, six foot one. He hits the free throw, extends the lead to 15 to three. 15 to three, wow. Tech playing good tenacious defense. defense. Very yeah. good defense. There's a blocking foul 15. call against Davis of Tech. So, Corey Schmidt three is all we've got for scoring at these. Devaney takes it in the lane, kicks it out to the corner. Three-point attempt by Adams, no good. Oh, no. And it 
looks like a foul Schmidt. on the rebound. That's going to be on Schmidt. Blanchett comes in. Schmidt comes out. So that was his second? Oh, no way. How many well, fouls do you have? I only, I only got only three. For one. <laughs> I know. Capello at the turnaround, no good. Devaney gets it across, takes it into the lane, lays it up, no good. Tipped Tips. up. Capetto has it tipped away on the rebound, but he eventually controls it. Three-point attempt, top of the key, no good. Long rebound, controlled by move Baraga. It, it. Yeah, no. Devaney. Yeah. Backs it out. Ursoni puts up a shot. Whistle. Yep. 15 is going to say. So that will be on Davis, oh. his second. Send her Sony to the line for two. So they got four fouls for Gilbert. I only had uh, three. So for Sony Corey hits Schmidt. the first. So, uh, so Corey... Uh, Schmidt must have two because they got four listed up there. I only had three. I only had three also. Yeah. Second shot around the rim and out. Rebound by Capetto. Yeah, Braga. Reed elbow jumper is good. Oh, a whistle. They, they touched the ball after it went through the basket. So uh, my interpretation is the second delay game results in a technical. Technical foul, yeah. Baraga, top of the key. Ersoni takes it inside. Travel. He's called for travel. That looked like the jump stop to me, huh? you know? They called one of that last night, too. The other Tuesday night. Reed in exchange, in Smalls exchange it, but it's Blanchett. stolen away by Banchette. Looks for the trailer, and taken away again. Eventually controlled by Devaney in the corner. Three point attempt is good yeah. by Ersoni. Ersoni for three. Oh, nice pass inside. It's going to stay there. Poked away by Devaney. It'll stay with Walcott Tech. 105 remaining in the first period. Tech on front, 17 to 6. He touched and it. It'll be a That's backcourt. Back court he touched it. Not, not called. I thought, no possession? Three point attempt from the wing is good. Despite Nolan Adams contesting he it. He is way out there, too. It's an interesting. Again, we saw the backcourt that we didn't really get. Blanchett for three. No good. Adams with the rebound. Devaney kicks it out. Ursoni down low to Baraga. In uh, and out. No good. Adams, Nolan Adams with the yeah, rebound. And rebound. he's fouled on the attempt. I didn't know four was in. He said four, four. Yeah, he had he just in, yeah. the game. That's Rosario. Magna Rosario, wow. yeah. First free throw by Adams is good. Second one up and in. 20 to eight, our score, 30 seconds remaining in the first. Sadati gets it into Capetto, spin move in the lane, now up and under, no good though. Nice move, but he, he couldn't got convert. Fouled. Bro, I got fouled. Tips it over to Sadati on the hustle play, who puts it up and in. Braga got fouled on that play. Blanchett for three. 
Air ball, no good. That's not how you want it. So a very, very productive first quarter for Oliver Walcott. They have a 14-point advantage here, 22-8. to eight. Stifling defense, Mike. You said it before. The Tech uh, Wildcats really are just putting the pressure on them. And, and uh, uh, Gilbert likes to run, likes to get the ball out there. They didn't get anything in transition. They were always back, and they had to try to run their set offense, and they were swarming. They'd get the ball down low to Braga, and they'd have two guys right on them the whole time. You know, So it was very difficult for the ball movement and then for Gilbert to score. So let's see if uh, Coach oh, yes. Douglas. Sorry. Yes. 